It will be a Friday that some drivers in Regina will want to forget. Multiple cars were left abandoned after a downpour created massive flooding. In some cases, water could be seen shooting out of storm drains a few feet into the air. Low-lying areas of the city, especially underpasses, quickly turned into lakes. And despite warnings from officials for drivers to not attempt to cross flooded areas, emergency vehicles had to be called in at multiple locations. A rescue boat was even used to reach people who were stuck in deepening pools of water. Officials have previously said they were looking at ways to mitigate flooding of the city's underpasses. That includes at Albert Street and Saskatchewan Drive, which is recorded to have flooded as early as 1912. We've got a lot of infrastructure in and around Saskatchewan Drive and Albert. And in order to try and determine the best engineered solution to how we deal with the water at that point, it takes time for us to look at that. That process has actually started. Now, Reginians begin the drying out process while they assess the damage left behind. And it looks like those hoping for a quick solution to the flooding problems in Regina's underpasses could be up a creek without a paddle. Alexander Kwan, CBC News, Regina.